Karibuni, karibuni wageni wetu Kilimanjaro 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 Kienda machame Kilimanjaro oh, oh, Kilimanjaro Kienda lemosho Kilimanjaro oh, oh, Kilimanjaro Kienda na lava Kilimanjaro oh, oh, Kensu and Cooperative Union started in 1933 to help farmers to make sure that the farmers are selling their coffee at the fair price. Mambo moto moto, mambo moto moto, ukienda machame, mambo moto moto, mambo moto moto, mambo moto moto, mambo moto the Fair Tourism Project is a project that KNCU initiated with some uh, donors from UK and uh, Holland to assist the farmers generate an additional income. And coffee tours were simply a product where you bring in your tourists to visit the farmers, st uh, stay with the farmers for half day. They learn about coffee production, then they, they went back to the hotels or whichever safari they are planning to get. <laughs> the idea was to establish a, what we call homestays, where the farmers could stay with the, with the tourists. So we decided to build about four accommodation huts, Chaga traditional huts. But they were basically uh, accommodation for tourists. And in year 2004, we came to realize that we were making mistakes because the private farmers or the land where we are using, we are building the huts on, the farmers thought that the project belonged to them and not to the community. The rest of the community realized that the project is not belong to the community but it belongs to those people where the huts were built. So we went ahead and it, there was a suggestion that we should establish a campsite for this uh, tourist. Then we established a campsite at one of the sites we call Uru. For this particular experience you get when you go to the Uru campsite, stay with the farmers, exchange ideas, participate in the coffee production process, visit their schools, learn about how education system is, is quite unique. And this is what we are saying. <laughs> the advantage that you can see bring to the community from Fair Tourism Project is just to, to have a fund to, to give us fund to establish coffee nursery, which enable us to get seedlings to distribute to the farmers, and the farmers get seedling to to plant their farm to get the wood yield. Actually, the nursery started for the aim of getting seedlings because. And uh, some few years, the farmers neglect the coffee according to the price wide, world in price wide. Now they neglect to maintain the coffee in their farm. And the coffee husbandry, after neglecting the, coffee, the farms, the coffee husbandry was, was neglected also. Now we're supposed to, to approve all the oldest plants to replace a new one, which will get good yield in the future. The coffee farmers themselves, nowadays they are very happy because Always, when we want to build a school like this one, we need to do contribution to these coffee farmers. But they are happy because through I mean, Fair Tourism Project, they get the money through to the project and they build the classroom. So they already save some money from their pocket, so they get money direct from the project. So they are very happy for that. These slopes of the Mount Kilimanjaro, we have some children who are... Uh, can say it's uh, often children. So the KNCU is also the one who helping the farmers just to pay the school fees to these uh, often children. We feel very happy when they come here, we change ideas with them, 
we know what's going on in the world of today. We will make friends. Na hiyo kreta